You feel like gang culture is as big over here in the East Coast as it is in the West Coast? You've been to both sides. Yeah. Yeah, I do. It's just, it's different, like, even down to the, the language, like, everything is different. Like, the whole gang culture out here is way different than it is how's on the culture, West Coast. How's gang culture out here influenced you? I feel like younger me it influenced me in a negative way. Like, it put me in, in certain situations that I shouldn't have been in. But the older me, it hasn't influenced me at all. Like, now I know, oh, this shit only lead to two things, like, jail and death. That's the sad part. Like, I lost so many friends and so many peers just to stupid shit that now it made me open my eyes. And the fact that I got kids now, now it made me open my eyes, like, yo, yeah, bro, that gang shit is whack. Like, that shit don't do nothing for you, you know? It's just, it's really about protection with niggas. But now it's it be like niggas is in too deep because now niggas done lost men, niggas done lost family members. So now niggas is, is no turning back. Now whatever's done is done. Whatever happens, happens. But at the same time, it be on some like, I don't know. To me, this shit don't really do nothing for you. Like, but negative shit. Like. So what would you say to somebody who wants to join a gang today? Like a kid that wants to join a gang today. If you join the gays in 2024, you're fucking stupid. You're a dickhead. Like, it's... it's. Well, let me speak to the kids first. Because the older niggas, if you join the gangs now, you're, a, you, you're literally a dickhead, bro. But to the kids who don't really understand what's going on, I don't even want to be on some preacher shit, but that shit only leads to jail and death, gang. Like, feel me? A lot of niggas who probably haven't really experienced grief or haven't experienced the system, they not going to really know what goes on until it really goes on. And sometimes niggas be learning the hallway. So before niggas even learn the hallway and put themselves in a situation that they can't get out of, don't even join the gang in the first place. Right. And that's the same way I'm going to raise my sons. Like, don't even... Put yourself in that predicament, like in the first place, because a lot, of, like a lot of niggas is gonna fold. You shit hit the fan, and you you find out your man's turn on you, and now you gotta sit down and do a certain football numbers. Like you're not gonna know what to do with yourself, like. So just stay out that shit, man. Shit's wild. You still fucking with um. That twenty two kid. What happened? <laughs> no, no. Some some stupid shit you heard, but I um. Cause he was producing for you at some point. Yeah, and he was in your music video. That music video was fire. So appreciate that again. I ain't gonna lie, like still one of my favorites. I ain't gonna lie. I just as far as that nigga, like I, I wish the best for him. You know? I hope everything he got going on. I hope it work out for him. Me personally, I'm just I'm on my I'm on a different path, and that path don't. A lot of niggas is not on that path. Like, a lot of niggas is not with me while I'm on this journey type shit. Mm -hmm. But it ain't, I ain't on no hate shit. I ain't on no beef shit with him. Like, feel me? It's a lot of niggas I don't fuck with no more. Like, it's no bad blood, though. Like, I don't know. All right, fucking, I don't believe we're inside the gully. How do you feel about cutting people off? That shit is so easy to be down. Like, I, I do that shit to fucking snap of a finger now. Just because I know, like, it, now I look at it as not, you're not even cutting people off. You're cutting dead weight off. Like, I don't even, if you not beneficial in no shape or form, and it, I'm, I'm not even talking about, like, material things. I'm talking about being beneficial to where I, if I could learn something from you, or you could put me in a better, like, better position. I don't really see no reason for you being around me. Like, I don't know. I'm just really on some gross shit. Like, not even on some preacher shit, though. But I'm on some gross shit. Like, I'm trying to grow. Like, niggas is getting older. Mm -hmm. Niggas got to stop being on that, that young nigga mindset, right? Mm -hmm.